Earth Action, Show Your Love for the Earth, by Della Verford. Dedication to Buckminster Fuller, who has been an inspiration to many. He believed we must have spontaneous cooperation, without any damage to the environment and without disadvantage to anyone. For his imaginative inventions and respecting and using nature as an honored teacher, his work became for humanity when realizing he was part of the universe. May his works encourage others to make their work for humanity and all living things. We live on a spaceship. The trouble is, an operating manual didn't come with it. We are not going to be able to operate our spaceship Earth successfully, nor for much longer, unless we see it as a whole spaceship and our fate as common. It has to be everybody or nobody. Children ought to understand the universe, and we teach them their ABCs. To honor Bucky, we have included six inventions and six activities in the Earth Action book. Once upon a time, there was an eagle child called Rainbow Wings. This eagle child was not an ordinary eagle, nor an ordinary child, but a mythical, imaginary creature that had an eagle's head, a child's feet, and legs. We do not know if the eagle child was a boy or a girl. We just know that Rainbow Wings was part magical child and could talk. The eagle child was given the name Rainbow Wings because of its beautiful, bright colored wings that shone with all the colors of the rainbow. Rainbow Wings lived in two places and had two families. Part of the time, Eagle Child lived in the mountains with Eagle brothers and sisters, the rest of the time in the city with human brothers and sisters. One hot day in the city, Rainbow Wings felt thirsty, took a drink from the lake, but the water was not clean, and Rainbow Wings became dizzy and sick. The air was also dirty and polluted. Rainbow Wings cried, I feel numb all over. My wings feel weak and my feathers are feeling stuck together. Rainbow Wings felt scared and sad. The beautiful colors were faded and gone. I have lost my power to fly. How can I get my power and colors back? Rainbow Wings knew of a place nearby with a wise one and decided to go for help. The wise one said, to get your power and magic colors back, you must go and meet the little people of the four directions. You must go east, then go south, then west, then north. You will travel through four seasons. The little people have some secret words called magical earth secrets. That will give you strength again. Earthseed said, here's the secret words. I and the earth are one. I love the earth. I will take care of the earth. Eagle Child said, the red on my wings is brighter and brighter. The Seasons Wheel. The season wheel turns. Spring eggs become chicks. Summer flowers blossom. Fall leaves turn color and fall. In winter, the bear takes a rest and sleeps and dreams. A flower dies, but its seeds go back to the earth. Spring seeds can sprout again. The season wheel turns. What is the best time to rest? Start something new and flower. The waste knot wheel. The energy to keep the waste knot wheel turning over and over again is coming from the sun, water, wind. Conserve nature's gifts that provide us with energy to live the life we want to live. When we throw garbage away, we are throwing away valuable resources. Recycle, reduce, and upcycle. Conserve and compost. Let the waste not wheel turn. Why is recycling, reducing, and upcycling important? Art Activity Love the Earth Mural Make magical earth secrets, art, love the earth murals. Here are examples from the Wandering Spirit Survival School. Buckminster Fuller. Buckminster Fuller was an inventor, architect, mathematician, futurist, and author. He is best known for the geodesic dome. Bucky popularized the term spaceship earth to emphasize, like a spaceship, the Earth is traveling at enormous speeds that we are all crew members on Spaceship Earth. We need to work together to take care of our small spaceship and protect our resources. Dymaxion House Buckminster Fuller designed a round house which combined the words dynamic, 
maximum, and tension to arrive at Dymaxia. He saw shortcomings in the existing home building techniques and addressed them in his invention. They used resources inefficiently and he intended them to be suitable to any environment. He came up with his inventions by looking at nature's designs. The geometric design was stronger than routine structures. He reduced water use and had an alternative shower called a fogger. They were easy to assemble, portable, and could be shipped easily. It used energy that was off the grid. This design had exciting new ideas. Your Damaxian House Design the interior of a Damaxian house. This house is a circular house designed by Bucky. Find a photo of something you love in nature. It might be a flower you love or your favorite animal. It can live on the ground, trees, water, mountains, or in the air. Look at the colors, shape, and textures of it and its surroundings. Use these colors, shapes, and textures in choosing furniture, flooring, colors, and accessories for your Dymaxian house. Draw the circular plan of your living room and or your bedroom as two circles. Place the furniture inside as shapes. Beside this, put photos of what you see from your windows, a mural, types of furniture, colors, and accessories. Sweetwater whispered the secret words, I and the water are one. I love the water. I will take care of the water. The eagle child saw as well as red, beautiful, orange color on its wings. Imagine the orange. The water cycle wheel. The water cycle turns. The sun heats the water. Some of the liquid gains enough energy to change into water vapor. The water vapor rises, cools, and becomes clouds. The water vapor in the clouds becomes liquid, sometimes freezes to become snow and hail. The sun heats the water, water wheel turns. Is the water and the air connected? The food chain wheel. The food chain wheel turns. The bald eagle eats salmon. The salmon eats herring. The herring eats zooplankton. The zooplankton eat phytoplankton. The sun's energy keeps the phytoplankton, the algae, green. The green algae absorbs and uses the sun's energy to make food. The sun brings forth a new day the food wheel turns. How are we connected to each other? Why is the sun and water important to all living things? Activity. Water dance. Remember the water secret. Study the water cycle wheel. Sit in a circle. Feel yourself become a wave. With your hands moving, whoosh in and out. Make the sound of the ocean. Feel the freedom of the moving water. Be the dolphin or a fish in the water. You can be sun rays, rainmakers, lakes, and snowflakes. Think of a water dance. Creative writing, your food chain wheel. Sweetwater teaches us about the water in the food chain wheel. Draw your own version of the food chain wheel. What kind of pollution can harm it? Flies Eye Dome. This dome structure was designed by Buckminster Fuller in 1965. He was designing with the idea of creating an affordable and portable home of the future. The name he has called it is the Fly's Eye Dome. It has a structure like the eye of a fly when looked at under magnification. It has openings in which solar panels could be used. Also, these openings could be a system for water collection. Bucky's Fly Eye Dome. This activity is to choose an animal or insect's eye and put the design on a sphere. You can also use an insect like the bee. Bucky really used nature as an inspiration for his designs. Draw the animal or insect that is the inspiration. Now draw how it would look on a sphere or a dome. Can your dome have solar panels or panels that catch water? For follow-up, you can make a spot dome with spots from an animal or butterfly on it. Sunray told his powerful secret words. I and the sun are one. I love the sun. The sun takes care of me. Bright yellow color grew on Eagle Child's wings. Imagine the yellow. The light wheel. The light wheel turns. Plants make their own food. The sun makes leaves green. Chlorophyll captures the sun's energy. Plants produce food for animals, birds, insects, and humans. Plants recycle oxygen. The sun shines. The light wheel turns. Music activity. 
color and sound. Sunray uses a bow to shoot and give colors to the flowers. There are many feelings of color with music. What colors do you feel when you listen to classical music, rock music, ethnic music? Without talking, draw the colors and shapes that you feel. Drama activity. Magical Earth costumes and play. Read the Magical Earth secret story and think of how you can put on a play or a skit. Think of one of the little people in the Magical Earth story. Do a costume for Earth Seed, Sweetwater, Sun Ray, Loved Wind, Starbird, Crystal Wish, and the Eagle Child. Make many costumes, make masks, make hats, capes, or wands. Use your imagination. Make Eagle Child wings to fly. Put on a Magical Earth Secrets play. Have each class do a different chapter of the story. Make an animal dance with Earth Seed, water dance with Sweetwater, fire dance with sun ray, wind dance with love wind, and star dance with starbird. Magical Earth Secrets, Magical Rainbow in Japan. Story by Della Burford. This was produced by Kazuko, Asaba, and Ruru, who also designed the costumes. Dymaxion Car. Buckminster Fuller invented a car called the Dymaxion. It was a most unusual shape, and he told his daughter it could be called a zoomer, as he really wanted it to be used on land, water, and even in the air. Copies were made of the ideas, but it was never produced on a large scale. It could steer in a tight circle, which caused a sensation. It showed up at the Chicago World's Fair in 1933 and 1934. Bucky really wanted to do more with less, and designed it to use less gas. Today, I'm sure he would use solar energy and come up with some incredible car inventions using new ideas. Love Wind whispered, repeat my secret words. I and the air are one. I love the air. I will take care of the air. My wings now have red, orange, yellow, and green, shouted the eagle child. I know I can fly high. breathing wheel. The breathing wheel turns. The sun makes leaves green. Leaves breathe in carbon dioxide and replenish the oxygen in the atmosphere. Oxygen that all animals and all humans must have in order to breathe. Oxygen and food are energy. Our breath releases carbon dioxide and leaves absorb the carbon dioxide in the day and oxygen at night. Daylight has come again. The birds sing. The sun makes the leaves green. The breathing wheel Activity, wind dance. Love wind blows a wind that lets us smell the perfume of the flowers. Remember the love wind secret. Feel yourself blowing in the wind. Feel yourself becoming a love wind. Think of someone who needs it and blow them love. Feel yourself a butterfly, a bird. Feel like the eagle receiving the colors. Think of a love the air dance. Biosphere, Montreal. The Biosphere, also known as the Montreal Biosphere, is a museum dedicated to the environment in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It is housed in the former United States Pavilion, constructed for Expo 67, located within the grounds of Parc Jean Drapeau on St. Helens Island. The museum's geode geodesic dome was designed by Buckminster Fuller. The structure was originally built for Expo 67, which officially opened on April 27, 1967. I went and saw the sphere at the expo and knew one day I wanted to meet Buckminster Fuller. Energy Drawing Dance Buckminster Fuller promoted the use of wind power. How is sun and wind energy connected? When the sun hits the Earth's surface, the moving air is called wind. It is caused by the uneven heating of the Earth. Choose one of wind, solar, water, pulled by the gravitational force of the moon, or geothermal, and draw individually how we get energy. Add your individual drawing to a mural and think how they all connect. For those creative in dance, do a storytelling with dance. Starbird said, I and the stars are one. I love the stars. I will take care of the stars. Eagle Child knew it wanted to fly to space after seeing the star bird come out of the darkness and learning the secrets. The Eagle Child received the power to fly to space and 
got rich blue on its wings. The starbird said, the stars like it when good people make wishes for the good of all. The Energy Again Wheel The Use Energy Again Wheel turns. Renewable energy is renewable. It can be used again. Solar energy, water energy, geothermal energy, wind energy are all alternative energy sources. They can give us heat, light, and energy to cook meals. They are powerful and renewable. We must be in gratitude. Activity. Energy differences. We all have energy in our bodies. Dance slowly, showing how you feel when you do these three different things. When you eat something good, when you do something good for the environment, and when you think good thoughts rather than bad thoughts. It is important to put out good thoughts for yourself, other, nature, and all aspects of the earth. Activity, body energy rainbows. Lie on a large piece of white paper, which is cut to the length of your body, and have someone else trace around you. Change the shape if you like. The first stage can be done with markers for more detail. Then you can think of, then you can use paint. Think of the elements of nature, sun, water, air, trees. Draw different things from nature in your body. Where in your body would you so, show the sun, the water, the wind, trees, flowers, and rainbow? Do you see a specific animal or bird? Fill your body with color. Show the energy around your body. What color, what pattern is it? Express your dreams and love for yourself and nature. Body Energy Rainbows Della facilitated a project at Christie St. School with the children making body energy rainbows of themselves. They also heard the story of Magical Earth Secrets, and since the book was inspired from a dream, they made dream stories. Dymaxion Map this map, designed by Buckminster Fuller, is a projection of the world map onto the surface of an icosahedron, which, when unfolded and flattened, becomes a two-dimensional map of the world. With this map, Bucky made a point that we are like one large island with oceans around a total world. He developed a game called the World Peace Game in 1961 to create solutions to overpopulation and uneven distribution of global resources. He felt the world should work for 100% of humanity in the shortest time through cooperation without damage to nature or disadvantage of anyone, thus increasing the quality of life. A project called Genie has been done by a team of people and used this map to show the amount of energy used in different parts of the world and how much quantity of potential solar and wind energy is possible in various countries. This can be seen on graphs online at the Genie website. It is my headquarters. So now to see all the world at once, with, without any visible distortion, of the relative shape, the relative size of any of the of data. Now this is very convenient because also I've been able to do it in such a way what we call the sinuses, where it breaks open. Uh, all in the water, so. There are no breaks in the continental contours which we have in all of our world. When Eagle Child met Crystal Wish, a wish was made. I wish the trees to grow, the water to be clean, the air to be fresh, and all the people to love and take care of the earth. Because you have made such a powerful wish for the good of the earth, Crystal Wish exclaimed, I will give you the color purple to complete the full rainbow on your wings. Imagine the full rainbow. The change wheel. The change wheel turns. A spark of life. An egg is formed. A caterpillar is born who weaves a cocoon from which a butterfly emerge. This is transformation. A spark of life. An egg is formed. The change wheel turns once again. How do we see transformations in nature? There is nothing in the caterpillar that tells you it's going to be a butterfly. Activity. A nature Wish Bureau. Every person should make a beautiful star. Draw, paint, or do a foil collage. Have everyone
everyone think of a wish for the good of the earth. Put the wish for the earth in the star. Glue them all on a large mural and paint the background. Activity. Creative movements. Metamorphosis. Show metamorphosis through movement. Show the transformation of a caterpillar into a butterfly. Show a tadpole growing into an adult frog or an environmental villain growing to be an environmental hero, heroine, or helper. Gumdrop tetrahedron. Make an equilateral triangle with nine small triangles with toothpicks and gumdrops. Build tetrahedrons on each triangle. Connect the apex point of each tetrahedron with each other to make four equilateral triangles. Connect the top with another tetrahedron to make a three-frequency tetrahedron. A simple geosphere. Fold plates into six equal triangles, like six pizza slices. Unfold and connect the plates at the center to create four bow ties. Connect the opposite angle of the triangles to each other to create a sphere, with six square faces and eight triangular faces. Eagle Child got a color from each person of the four directions. It now had the full rainbow. Those who learned the secrets did everything they could to help the Earth. Everyone made a difference. All is one. Make an environmental picture book to show your love for the Earth. Song for Eagle Child, Earth Seed, Sweet Water, Sun Ray, Love Bird, Star Bird, and Crystal Wish. The Season Wheel connected to the Waste Knot Wheel. The Waste Knot Wheel connected to the Food Chain Wheel. The Food Chain Wheel connected to the Water Wheel. The Water Wheel connected to the Light Wheel. The Light Wheel connected to the Breathing Wheel. The Breathing Wheel connected to the Energy Again Wheel. The Energy Again Wheel connected to the Change Wheel. The Change Wheel connected to the Season Wheel. Oh dear Mother Earth, the Earth, the Earth. Mother dear Earth, the Earth, the Earth. Mother dear Earth, all wheels connected, all is one. Oh dear Mother Earth. Eagle Child Hat. Wear the Eagle Hat to feel your power, to love and protect the Earth. Color the colors you love. Enlarge or glue on heavier paper attached to a band. Fly like the eagle. Become an astronaut. In developing the Earth Action Book, I got immersed in Buckminster Fuller's philosophy. He saw our planet as Spaceship Earth. As my partner in development in the Space Camp mission, William Meyerhoff says, Bucky popularized the term Spaceship Earth to emphasize that like a spaceship, the Earth is traveling at enormous speeds, spinning at a thousand miles per hour, rotating around the Sun at 67,000 miles per hour, while our solar system is whizzing through the galaxy at 490,000 miles per hour. We're all crew members on Spaceship Earth. We need to work together to take care of our small spaceship and protect its resources. I've looked at the Dymaxion map, which Bucky designed, and put all the countries that influence my developing magical Earth secrets. We have traveled to many, and in some, the story has been story told and performed. These include India, Wales, Ireland, Scotland, Peru, Mexico, Canada, USA, Bali, Korea, and Japan. To my surprise, I found the form on the map in the shape of an eye. Look at the Dymaxia map. Pinpoint places that inspire you and you'd like to travel to, by yourself or with a group. Find some travel pictures to add to the map. If in a group, make a big travel destination map. Della Burford. Magical Earth Secrets is danced in the story and has been danced in New York, Edmonton, Japan, and Bali. Also in school performances. Della Burford is a Canadian artist and author based in Vancouver Island. She studied interior design at NYSID textiles at U of A, education in the artist community of BED program at Queen's University. She learned Mischtechnik of the Flemish and Italian Renaissance painters in Vienna. She taught interior design for six years at Humber College. Her first book published, Writing and Art, in the 1977 Journey to Dodo Land, won a PIA award for design. Della won first in graphic art for her painting Shaman's Eye in the Visionary Art Show in Moscow. She has shown her painting in Toronto, Bali, 
and with the Society for Art of Imagination in Ottawa, Montreal, New York, Peru, and London, England. She has facilitated workshops around her books in New York City, Canada, through Inner City Angels, Ontario Art Council, and Canada Council. Also shared in Guatemala, Mexico, Sweden, Holland, England, Korea, Japan, and Bali. Journey to Dodo Land was chosen to launch the government-sponsored Swift Shore and became an e-zine and website that has two million people visit. Her book, Magical Earth Secrets, was a bestseller in Canada. It has been a play in New York, Edmonton, and Japan. Her work is encouraging others to be creative, to take action, to help the earth, and make a difference in the world. She loves co collaborating and in doing Trim Tab Space Camp, Design Science Redo program with the Buckminster Fuller Institute in 2021, and did the final edit of Earth Action. She is very grateful for all who have helped her take this work to the world. Her work is for self-development, humanity, and the world. Dale Bertrand was born in Prince Rupert, BC, and raised in California and Western Canada. He studied photography at three small schools, Toronto, and desktop publishing at Ryerson. He has photographed in Wales, Japan, India, Hawaii, Guatemala, Peru, Thailand, Mexico, and Bali. He was communication manager for the Harborfront Antique Market for eight years. Dale has had various art shows of the early Canadian artist. Dale has had various art shows of the early Canadian artist Tom Hugh Huron Roberts and produced six books on his father, John Hugh Roberts, mystical Celtic writing. Dale did some background paintings for Magical Earth Secrets and co-authored the original activity cards. In Journey to Dodo Land, he created giant flower islands. He participated in the Guatemala production of Dodo Land and in the storytelling of Magical Earth Secrets in Korea. He joined Della in Japan to see Magical Rainbow. Dale has designed with Della the Dodo Land in Cyberspace website that was created in 1995 as a ch children e-zine. It has had two million visitors. Dale has led many workshops such as Medicine Wheels and Art Murals with Inner City Angel and environmental posters in the Nanimo Art Gallery program. His canvases done with children were taken to the future meeting in Stockholm. He has shared druidical quest in workshops both in Holland and Bali. Dale has taught English in Mexico doing startup for Canadian school. He has taught 10 years and communications business at an English school in Vancouver. He's pre presently a caregiver for indigenous youth in the Vancouver area, as well as keeping his love of beads and antiques hobby going.